Hello guys, welcome to Hawaii's tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you on how to design a restaurant flyer in Corregro. So let's begin. As you can see, these are the three colors I'll be using for the design. That this is the gradient color, and this is also the details that I'll be using for the design and the picture that I'll be using for the design. So step one is to change your page size to A5, just like this. After that, double click on your rectangle to add a page frame. Then right click on this blank space to remove the outline so after that click on your interactive field tool here and click on this copy field properties to copy this gradient color so i've done the gradient color myself so now as you can see so now the next step is to click on your rectangle tool just like this then draw a rectangle just like this increase it a little bit now after that click on your shift tool then click on this node here, hold, hold it down with your left click, then reduce it just like this to give it a smooth curve. After you're done with that, drop the tool or press space on your keyboard. Now move this with your right click this side and choose power clip this side to power clip the shape into the page frame. So now the next step is to edit content, then bring this shape upward, increase the outline to four points, just like this. So after that, you need to give this outline a color by right, -click, right clicking on this sand color to give it an outline. So now you can now increase the outline to 8 points. So after that, click on it to bring out this rotational skew here, then rotate it just like this. Then bring it upward. And now reduce it a little bit. And just like this. So after you're done with that, click on your rectangle tool, then draw a rectangle by the control to make all sides equal. Sorry, to make all sides equal, then click on your shape tool here, then adjust the smoothness here, that is the curve smoothness, then click on the middle to bring out this rotational scale, then adjust, I mean to rotate it just like this. Then give this a color, a deep color here. I right click to take off the outline. You can now reduce it, bring it to this side, increase it a little bit. Now right click on it, go to order, then send it to the back of page. Now you can now increase it a little bit. Press Ctrl D to duplicate it. Now bring the duplicate one to the down here, then reduce it. Just like this. So after you're done that, click. Sorry, this this has to the page. After you're done that, click finish editing object. As you can see, this has been this has been done. The next step is to pack clip this picture into this page frame. Now move the picture with your right click, and then choose pack clip inside. Now edit content, pack clip it into the shape again. Now edit content. Now increase the picture. Just like this. Now adjust the picture into the shape. And click finish editing objects so you still need to adjust it a little bit then click finish editing object so after that click finish editing object then press shift f4 to so zoom everything to page so after that you see this shape also needs some adjustments just like this rotate it and bring this downward here just like this. Now bring this to this side and bring this to this side. After that, click finish editing objects. So the next step is to click on your ellipse tool and draw a circle just like this. Then click on your sand color here. Then right click on this deep yellow to give it an outline. Then increase the outline to four points. So after that, bring this here. So reduce it a little bit. Then press Ctrl D to duplicate it. Now increase this a little bit. Press Ctrl D to duplicate it. So now after you're done with that, the next step is to click on your text tool and type 
in fact guest price rates then press ctrl e press ctrl e to align everything to the center then reduce the font to 11 and click on it then click on this board to board it now I'll zoom it a little bit so after that you can now reduce it just like this now I light the two of it then press c and e to align everything vertically and horizontally reduce it a little bit so after that click on text to then type 40 percent discount Press Ctrl A and E to align everything to the center. Then reduce the font to 11. Then place on this B to boot it. Then bring it to this side. Now you can now increase this 40%. Increase the font to 12. So repeat the same step here. Increase the font of this best. Increase it to and just like this so increase this also then align I mean hold shift and click on this circle then press letter C and E to align everything vertically and horizontally after that so you need to do this and another one again so by clicking on your text tool, then type best delivery service so press ctrl e and ctrl e to align everything to the center now click on this board now reduce the fonts to 10 and bring it here now increase it a little bit so after that Align it and press the C and E to align it both vertically and horizontally. Now press Shift F4 to zoom everything to page. So after you have done that, you can now align this. Press Ctrl G to group it. You can now increase this a little bit. So repeat the same step to this also. Press Ctrl G to group it. Increase a little bit. Increase the. Repeat the same step. So after that, the next step is to bring these your details to the design here. That is the services offered and the address and the phone number on the design. So now, as you can see, here are the design, I mean the services and the address. So after that, press Shift L4 to zoom everything to page. Then the next step is to click on your text tool. The text to then type logo here yeah. so after that you give the font a falcon font you can download this font at dafont.com so now increase it and bring it here now I light it now give this a color that is this deep yellow color and this also this sand color so now after that you can now reduce you can now reduce this a little bit so now the next step is to click on your rectangle to draw it like this now hold I mean click on your shift to and adjust the smoothness here then right click on this to give it an outline here increase the outline to four points now hold shift and reduce it like this then right click to duplicate it then give it this color then right click to move the outline then align it then press ctrl g to group it now reduce it then bring it to this side reduce it a little bit so after that align it then press c and I mean e and c e only rather to align everything vertically I mean horizontally so those those are the shortcuts showing on the on your screen so you can know all what I'm pressing on my keyboard here so after that align this and press ctrl G to group it and reduce it a little bit 
and bring it up here so after that i think everything is done here so if you have any questions to ask me you can see these are the this is how to design a restaurant flyer in corridor so if you have any questions to ask me leave it down in the comment section and i will answer you so thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe thanks